So I want to show, show you something real quick. Uh, this is a piece I got from 2.6 Engineering and it allows me to adapt a 10AN fitting to my power steering pump. See it's got a little bit of a offset center because of this bad boy. But I always can never get this damn thing to seal. Uh, they come with a pretty wide clamp and everything, but uh, this is going to allow me to put a 10A in fitting, which uh, I got plenty of, and run it over here to my Chase Bay's uh, power steering reservoir. But this pissed me off so damn much, it will it would just constantly leak, and before you know it, I'd be out of power steering fluid. So hopefully, I can run possibly maybe a new 10A in line uh, to this 10 an adapter uh, piece from 26 engineering and get rid of this stupid leaky fitting which didn't make sense in the first damn place let me know what you think I'm making this video just for you now I wanted to show you what I did with uh, my power steering setup so I got this uh, kit from Chase Bays and pretty much it's a really nice high pressure line to an AN fitting uh, over here to an AN adapter fitting for the R33. This is the R33 power steering pump which I believe you also have but uh, you still use the R32 GTR pulley so that way everything lines up and you don't have to buy a new crank pulley or all that other stuff. But down here, I'm trying to get a good video of it, uh, I have the adapter from 26 Engineering, which the dude you've been messaging, uh, his adapter is really nice and it works. Uh, but it allowed me to just stick a, a 10 AN uh, fitting and run over here to this Chase Bays, which is also a 10 AN fitting down here. But the return line from the power steering rack is another, uh, I believe that's a 6AN fitting. And it goes, I ran it all the way down the firewall, which, there you can see it there. Oh, look, there's a, a good view of uh, that guy. But yes, uh, here's where I mounted the power steering pump where the charcoal canister was. Because with these filters, it didn't want to mount right there too well. Uh, it was just too much tight and now I have a big open spot here which uh, looks kind of funny without a power steering reservoir there but uh, ignore my other projects I just got done uh, replacing the oil main seal down there but uh, if you need I have this R33 power steering reservoir if you want it but, uh, get rid of this stupid thing i had so many problems with this leaking but yeah that's what his an adapter replaces and uh i i was always running out of power steering fluid because of this bad boy so uh, ditch this get the 2.6 uh engineering adapter and if you want you can do the chase bays uh power steering reservoir kit like i did uh, it's worth your time and money. It's a little bit cleaner setup. Uh, I might put some padding right there so that doesn't rub the living shit out of that AC line. Um, other than that, if you got any questions, man, let me know. That's what that looks like.